Hello YouTube. So first of all, I would like to welcome you all to uh, my first educational video. Let me start with a vaccination. I'll try to make it easier and much smarter for you to remember this with the visual mnemonics. So what you can see here, there is a packet of secret that is BD. Once I will open this BD, OP guy book will come. And this is designed by Mr. JETD. BD. Let me change the color so that it will be easier for you to appreciate this. Mm, add the red. It is BD, OP, and Mr. JETD. Uh, what is the mnemonic? It is BD, OP, Mr. TD. So from BD, there is B, BCZ, D, DPT, FB, HIV. And from OP, let me complete this. From OP, it is oral polio vaccine, pneumococcal conjugate vaccine, and there is uh, something called as I also. Since I have completed i have not written this previously because i just wanted you to note this okay it is o p i o p and from i it is fractional injectable polio vaccine so okay and from i it is fractional injectable polio vaccine okay okay now from mr td let me again complete this it's mr J E T T. It's Mr. J E T T. And from J E, it is Japanese encephalitis. From J E, it is Japanese encephalitis. So, yes, now you have remembered all this name. You have remembered all this name. From B D O P, Mr. J E T T. From B, it's B C Z. From D, it is D P T. It's I V. It's E V. Then from uh, OP, it is oral polio vaccine, pneumococcal conjugate vaccine, fractional injectable polio vaccine. From Mr. JETD, it is MR means measles rubella, GE means Japanese encephalitis, and TD means tetanus diphtheria. Okay, okay, okay. So, what's what's new? Again, let's revise. From B, it is BCZ. From D, it is DPT, HEB, and as IV. From OP, OP guidebook, no? OP, from O, it's OPV. From B, it is pneumococcal conjugate vaccine. And from I, it is fractional injectable polio vaccine. So, uh, after opening that packet of cigarette book came, and this concept was entirely designed by Mr. J E T D. From M R, it is measles rubella. From J E, it is Japanese encephalitis. And from T D, it is tetanus diphtheria. Okay, this is my photo. Now, why I have uh, created this is to give you idea of two things. The first important thing that I I, I want you to say is that. Uh, in which site the vaccine is given site i want you to remember the site and i also want you to remember how these vaccines are given by which route so i would like to you i like you to remember these facts one is site next is route okay and this can be easily remembered by uh, remembering my by looking my my own photo okay so I'll first like, like to make your concept clear that if it is intradermally, then it is given parallel to the skin. If it is intramuscularly, then it is given perpendicular to the skin. If it is subcutaneously, then it is given in the angle of 45 degree, in the angle of 45 degree, if it is subcutaneously. So now again, let me start. All of you know that BCG is given on the right arm. So let's begin with this fact. BCG is given in the right arm and what does this mean? This means BCG is given intradermally. Since I have made this parallel with this K, it is given intradermally and it is given on the right upper arm. It is given on the right upper arm. This is a right side and this is left side. Okay. Now, after I give BCG, now it will be easier for you to remember this on your own. Now, I have, I can remember this on my own, but to make this easier, I'll just say small mnemonic. And that mnemonic is same, B, B, D. So, B and this is D. D means diphtheria, pertussis and tetanus. So, how is this given? This is given at the angle of 90 degree. This is given at the angle of 90 degree. Means, 
this is given intramuscularly and where it is given it is given on the left it is left left side of my body i'm sorry the left uh, in this sequence okay and this is given on upper lateral thigh now remember one thing everything is lateral everything's lateral okay this is given on the left side okay so and this is given intramuscularly because it is given in the angle of 90 degree so op and sorry bd and after that bd what comes op o means oral polio vaccine and oral polio vaccine are given either two or three drop it's finished it's given uh, from the oral route now after o there is p p means pneumococcal conjugate vaccine now we first completed this then we came to sorry then we came to this now we will go to this this is pneumococcal conjugate vaccine and this is given same 90 degree angle it is given at the angle of 90 degree this is given at the angle of 90 degree so pneumococcal conjugate vaccine it is given intramuscularly on the left sorry sorry uh, this is not left this is right okay i have made uh, i have made a small mistake this is right this is given on the right mm, this is given on the right r i g s t yeah right upper lateral thigh okay i have given this in the right upper lateral thigh so after giving this on the right upper lateral thigh which is intramuscular root now let me again come back to the mnemonic which is b d o p i is remaining and it is fractional injectable polio vaccine f i p fractional injectable polio vaccine i will say this even without mnemonic i will say to you only because it will be easier for you also first let me say with mnemonic fractional injectable polio vaccine and this fractional injectable polio vaccine it is given intradermally because it is given just parallel to the skin fipv is given internal intradermally and it is on the left upper arm okay so now listen me bcc is given in this uh, in the right upper arm dpt is given on the left upper lateral thigh bcc is given here dpt is given here now this and this side of the body are remaining i'm trying to say that diagonal is already given now diagonal is remaining so bcc is given on the upper dpt is given on the lower now what is remaining this side and this side are remaining so pcv is given on this side this side means on the right side and finally fipv is given on the left side and also remember one thing bcc is given intradermally fipv is also given intradermally right the first four vaccine they are alike with each other bcc is given intradermally fipv is given intradermally dpt is given intramuscularly and pcv is given intramuscularly finished this is without mnemonic and with mnemonic i have already said remember bd and from bd op and from op mr j t d so bd op is completed now let's come back to the mr j e t d so from mr mr it is measles and rubella and this mr is given at the angle of 45 degree means it is given subcutaneously and also this is given on the left upper arm this can be easily appreciated from this now mr j j means japanese encephalitis japanese encephalitis is given at the angle of 45 degree and since this is given at the angle of 45 degree it is i have not written this so let me let me write uh, it is given since it is given 45 degree is given at the angle at the uh, mode subcutaneous mode and it is given on the right right upper lateral thigh lateral thigh very simple very simple to understand this everything is completed bcc is completed dpt is completed pcv is completed fipv is completed and mr z td mr is completed since, since mr come first it is given up mr is completed j is completed now what is remaining td is remaining tetanus diphtheria so for this i need a girl so i have take the photo of my mom to give you a visual impression so you can say me yes this is 90 degree it means it is given it is given intramuscular very good this is given intramuscular it is given to the left upper arm yeah this is left side now yes everyone can appreciate this is left side yeah so and this is given by uh, <laughs> injection of course of course by injection okay so this much i have taught you mnemonic i have taught you mode and site where it is given for mnemonic it is easier remember that there is tobacco that tobacco is bd 
BD, BD gave rise to OP book and this concept is created by Mr. ZTD. Even if you can uh, make your own name and it is very good. But yes, try to remember this thing with uh, your own way and my way, one of my ways of, of remembering this site and mode is creating a visual impression. Yeah, now remember one thing and that one thing is BCC is the only vaccine which is given as 0.05 ml dose. FIPV, since it is fractional, so it is given at the dose of 0.1. Okay. And all other vaccines, they are given at the dose of 0.5 ml. And also, there comes uh, in our EPA schedule, there comes droplet uh, mode of giving vaccine, not only injection, and that is oral polio vaccine and rotaviral vaccine. Oral polio vaccine too, remember too, but um, yeah, um, some um, you know uh, standard photos say some standard uh, authorities say it is three also but remember two yeah it's it's completed so let me show you this oral polio vaccine and uh, now oral polio vaccine it's given two to three drop okay oral polio vaccine it is given two to three drop yeah and uh, this is one of the latest upa schedule of nepal okay and now see this is completed so what i have taught you i have taught you mnemonic i have taught you uh, the site and the mode of giving the vaccine and i have taught you dose now finally let's come to the visits okay let's come to the visits so the first visit the first visit it occur at first within 24 hour okay it's better to give the vaccination within 24 hour so the first visit occurs immediately after birth okay so um, it occurs immediately 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 after birth after birth and this is it is it is which vaccine is given immediately after birth it is bcc vaccine and it's by injection okay uh, as simple as that so in the second visit second visit occur at sixth week sixth week so which vaccine is given on the sixth week it is two droplet three injection and remember one thing this injection is very painful injection this uh it is called as pentavalent vaccine it is very painful injection so it is given at last so it is given at last so two droplets which, which are given they are oral polio vaccine and rotaviral vaccine one is uh duita bund jindagi ko lagi so it is all oral polio vaccine polio ko thopla so this is oral polio vaccine and in the sixth week of visit two droplets and three injections are given yeah okay and i would like you to remember this yourself but how i remember since i am nepali i have created one uh, mnemonic and that is first second ek dui teen Kin, kin, FIPV kin, kin way, FIPV kin, kin, FIPV kin. Okay, anyway, char, 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 pneumonia bhaka, chodkar. Anyway, create a visual mnemonic, na, na, use your own way to remember this. Tin, FIPV kin, char, pneumonia. Means, char means car, my own, you know, imagination, and car manse, then pneumonia bhaka manse, like, hilera soba patuma. Okay, anyway, so oral polio vaccine, rotaviral vaccine, FAPB, PCV, and DPT at, at this pentavalent vaccine. And remember one thing this pentavalent vaccine is given on the second, third, and fourth visit. And something changes, so I will say what changed. Mm -hmm. Now, sixth week, third visit, this occurs at 10th week. So, on third visit, we give sorry on third visit we give oral polio vaccine rotaviral vaccine pneumococcal conjugate vaccine pentavalent vaccine but we do not give fapv and where we give fapv this fapv is given on the fourth visit and where this fourth visit occurs the fourth visit occurs at 14th week okay and also remember this oral polio vaccine is given all three 
frequencies and all three frequencies but rotaviral vaccine only is given on the sixth and tenth week or second or third visit so it's easier to remember this beta thubla beta thubla beta thubla tinta injection duta injection duta injection okay now when this fifth visit occurs and also how i remember fifth visit is i remember this this prime minister and <laughs> this yesterday mcc was passed i don't know what happened but still i'm okay with this so this prime minister i, I remember for fifth visit so any can anyone see me how many times sir bahadur deva became a uh, prime minister fourth time no so it's i think it's his um, i may sorry uh, it may be his fifth time also when he will become again president uh, next time but yeah i may be wrong also but if you know the correct answer then please comment comment on uh, comment section okay how many times uh, sir bahadur deva became president uh, sorry prime minister <laughs> not president <laughs> okay okay so yeah let's come back to study mm, let's come back to study and it is fifth visit pm prime minister pm pm prime minister pneumococcal conjugate vaccine and mr so on the sixth bit it is one and only je and on the seventh vaccine it is second dose of mr finished it's just completed so what i have taught you i have first taught you mnemonic then i have taught you site and i have taught you uh the dose and now i have taught you visits okay and this is mnemonic this is very good mnemonic the mnemonic of second visit um, and it will be applicable for third and fourth visit also teen fip vikin char pneumonia bhaka chod kar or char pneumonia bhaka manse like gaadi chalai rasa char means car pneumonia bhaka manse gaadi chalai rasa anyway and fifth visit means it's for pm for remembering pm um, i think when he will this sir bahadur deva will again be prime minister it will be his fifth time so anyway fifth visit is pm so pneumococcal conjugate vaccine and measles rubella and now this is uh, latest immunization schedule of nepal this is latest uh, national immunization schedule of nepal i like you uh, to stop this video and to take a screenshot of this uh, video of this uh, photo so yeah so i have completed uh, this short and sweet topic uh, thank you so much for this